Hey, what's up everyone? Bubble King here and welcome back to some more Paladins. Today we're going to be playing Barak here. He got some very uh, slight changes to his weapon. It got slightly buffed, so now you do a bit more damage when you hit less shots on a target. And with that, we're also going to be trying out the uh, Tinkering uh, Legendary here, which makes the Blunderbuss now have improved fall off, better shot clustering, and dealing extra damage as well. So. Uh, hopefully we can get some nice damage with our gun, thanks to that, and shoot people a bit further. We're going to go with this deck here. It's a bit of a rocket boost deck, so you can see we've got the cooldown reduction for rocket boost. Uh, we've also got bowling ball for the shield. Then we've got the pretty basic killing station forge alloy set up there uh, to give us a bit of sustain as well. But yeah, we're going to use the rocket boost to move around, get a nice big shield which we can use to uh, fight people. Oh, take that. Okay, I'm, we're going for a pretty big flank here. Holy crap. Um, get that mount down, bro. There's this Drogus here. I don't know what he's doing. But I'll pick him up. Okay, so we're behind this guy. He's trying to dodge. There's too many people here, though. That was a pretty easy cleanup, not going to lie. That guy's going to run because we've got people controlling the point. I'm going to put a turret here, I think. And that's a pretty good position because it's kind of hard for them to see, especially like the... Uh, Drogos and stuff, unless they come around the corner. There's someone back here, the Eevee. Now, Eevee got a lot of changes this patch. She shoots super quick now. So, we have to watch out about her. Um, they're moving on to the point. See if we can hang back a bit and still get some decent damage down. That'd be a bit hard, though. Oh, God. He's gonna come in here, is he? Oh, shit. Oh, no, we missed him. Oh, we hit him, but we need to reload. Oh, we dodged it. Oh, he's still alive. Oh my god, we killed him. Holy shit, okay, we're still alive. Oh. oh I think we got healed by someone there. I think the Ceres might have healed us up. That was really nice. If she did. Oh, he's so low. We can get in there and pick him up as well. It's actually nice just being able to deal, like, okay damage at a range now. Because usually you're super short range with Barak and you can't really do anything if they move even uh, slightly far. I mean, we still don't have perfect damage at range. You can see they were dealing like 100 and something, which is not too great. But uh, let's see if we can get close to these guys so we can throw down our ult. Okay. We'll try and control the point of here. Take down the tank. Now we can get the healer a bit easier. We need to pick up Cauterize, I think, eventually. Um, when we die. Getting some nice heals from our friends though, so that's good. Set up the turret here again, because it's quite hard for them to see it. And okay, what's going on here? Someone coming around the side. See if he's quite annoying. She shoots so quickly now. We've got Drogas on the backside down. I'm going to hug the wall here again. It's a bit harder for him to uh, see us take us out. Evie's trying to shoot us on the side here. I'm going to throw up my shield. Um, can we get the Drogo that like he's down? It's actually a pretty good position. They don't really see us too well until they come around the corner. Um, that gives us a good opportunity to get some early damage down onto them. This Eevee seems to be one of the only ones that can get some really good damage down on our team. Uh, oh shit, we're going. We're in the... We're in the ult there, so we can't really use our rocket boost to get some shielding there. Oh! To protect us a bit. We're in a bit of trouble here. We've got people behind us as well, which really sucks. Yeah, that was a really bad position. We had people behind us and in front of us. Uh, I'm gonna get Wrecker here so we can deal with this Ruckus a bit easier. I don't think Maldam's getting too much healing off, and we got Cauterize stacked on uh, Ceres here anyway. So. Probably don't need too much. Oh shit. Punch the other guy. Oh, he's not punching anyone? What? Oh, okay. I thought he would come for me. Like, usually, uh, being a tank, you're a pretty big target, but... Yeah, I don't know. Maybe he tried to go for the other tank or something. I didn't really see what was going on there too well. Oh, they're a bit low. Can we finish them off? I'm gonna try and shield for our friend. They're gonna come around the other side. Throw down the ult. He's trapped inside it. They have a couple low people here. 
Gonna try and pick up this guy. He dashed into the wall. That's good. It helps us a lot. Gonna try and get close to him. We've got the Wrecker, so he should be shredded quite quickly. We're actually in the lead here, which is pretty good. That's always nice. Our Dharma here. I think our Bomb King got picked up. I didn't shield in time. Doesn't help. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm gonna die here. Yeah. I can't use my Rocket Boost in that ultimate. Okay, well, we're able to max out our Wrecker here, so Rocket shouldn't be too much of a problem anymore. Uh, that's good. Because he was one of the big problems, I think. He just takes so long to take down. We've got Eevee behind us. Oh, I didn't activate F quick enough. The problem with Eevee, though, is she got the Ice Block heal. So every time we try and take her down, she's just going to heal up, especially since we don't have uh, Quarter Rides or anything like that. She's going to do this over and over. So, yeah, and fly away. And there's nothing we can do about it. It's so annoying. Um, oh, big ol'. Big ol' on the face. Okay, let's reload and try and get a bit close if we can. Get these down. Get the Maldambra as well. Oh, okay, that, that was good. We got the healer and the tank. That's actually a pretty big deal. That will delay him quite a bit there, I think. Uh, I'm going to get Life Rip, I think. Because we're dealing a bit extra damage, and I don't think Ceres is getting that many opportunities to heal us anymore. Um, get his EV. Get the guy over here, maybe? Gonna have the problem with Eevee, we always do. Is she just gonna heal up? I think. Or is she. Oh no, she got away from us. She got away from us again. Oh, she was so late that time as well. Oh, we're getting healed up, so we can actually fight here. Did no one take him out? Or is she, did he actually get away? Oh my god, I think he got away. That is crazy. I thought he was for sure dead, so I didn't rocket beast after him. Um. Uh, Trying to get him out of number. Should be dead. Got Ruckus on the backside here. Gonna reload because I can't really see him at the moment. He should be dead here. Okay, that's good. He's down. On the top here. I'm super low. Oh shit. Is Eevee gonna blink after me? I'm getting healed by Ceres, which is nice. So I can come out here without too much trouble. Trying to shoot this guy down. We accidentally walk into the... Oh, that's not great. I'm trying to get this Eevee. She's going to Ice Block again. i got to focus on someone else until she comes out of Ice Block. I don't know where she went now. <laughs> Good damage. So annoying. Oh. And she goes in Ice Block again. Yep. And now she's out of there. <laughs> so hard to deal with. Get Maldam on the backside here. Throw it up. He's going to shield up. First three shields. Oh. We can get our friends to tank for us. While we go heal up here on the backside. We got like a good 70 point lead, I say. Oh, no. We got stunned here. Oh, damn. I was going to try and dash onto the point and use my ultimate. Because we could zone him off it quite easily. But we got burst down before we could get onto it. Okay. Uh, she's gonna just get away here. Yeah, no point really trying to chase her, I think. Okay, let's see. Let's go throw this ult down, because we need to reload. Oh, god, I got it outside the shield there, because... Um... Damn. I got outside the shield, because Drogos was hanging out inside. And he was able to shoot us, and we're quite low, and as soon as we die, the shield goes down, so... I wanted to get out of there. Oh, god, they caught up really quick here. Holy crap. Um, trying to get this healer down. Oh, we're so low. Oh, shit, Ceres is trying to heal us. Damn it! I walked around the corner, and I screwed over our Ceres so. there. I shouldn't have walked around, because then she couldn't heal me. That was silly of me. Okay. Let's 
go, let's go, let's go. Got to go on the points so we can actually stop them building up points here. I thought someone was shooting us from behind, that's why I threw the shield up like I did. It turns out no one was. At least I didn't see him where they went. Man, so hard to dodge these EV shots now. Okay, let's get this guy. Oh, okay, he didn't get his ult off, which is good. I'm trying to get the test opponent a bit so he can't just capture it and win. Oh, okay, we, we're building up our point lead again, though. That's the important part. We need to keep this good gap. Actually, the time's almost out. Holy crap, we got it. Okay. That's good. I never had that before, actually. Usually the game ends in time. But it actually went the uh, full duration um, that time. Usually I, um, usually one team hits 400 points first. So if it was a really low, it must have been a, quite a low kill game or people were contesting the point a lot. Oh no, he's going to blow us up here, is he? No, he didn't hit us actually. We got behind the... Sure. Wait, that, that should damage us for like 450 or something, right? Hey, and we got our summon chest. That's why we're doing this, aren't we? <laughs> okay, so how do we go here? With the extra damage, did it really work out? It actually did. We actually did really good damage. Holy crap. I mean, it's not amazing, but we are a tank and quite a short range one at that, so it's pretty good that we actually dealt that much damage. Um, Quite a decent score. Yeah, that Eevee was absolutely wrecking the... 23-6. So hard to kill Eevee. And now it's so easy to uh, hit your shots with her as well. There's very, very little uh, outplay potential. When she's shooting so quickly and can just heal to full life and run away if it gets bad. And that's a really good pick for this type of mode because then you don't end up not giving over credits for when you die. Where even though we were getting quite a good score here with 17-8-14, which is the best on our team by a pretty good margin. Um, we sort of end up giving credits over anyway when we die because we don't have the way to get out of trouble as well. Like, even though we have the rocket boost with the extra shielding when we use it, rocket boost is quite a short range escape. Uh, you can only really use it to dodge like a big ultimate or something. Uh, you can't really use it to dodge a lot of attacks or get out of like actual danger. It's not a really big uh, disengage tool. But yeah, that legendary actually felt quite good. We were dealing pretty decent damage at decent ranges. Um, I really like having the Taurus just being able to auto aim because I always want to play like a... Like in TF2, I played like the NG and stuff because I just love building turrets and just letting that destroy everyone. Um, but that actually felt quite nice playing with uh, this legendary. It actually felt like your gun deals decent damage at most ranges, I guess. I mean, you're still like a short range character. You you definitely excel when they're right in front of you, but you can actually deal okay damage at longer ranges, which is nice. Um, yeah, so that worked out quite well. Really good game. We got some low damage on both teams that sort of equalize each other out. I think we got some good healing from Sarah, so that really made up for it. We had double tank and a good healer, which Sort of worked out. You can see Torvald here goes crazy time on the point. Especially with his changes to his health and shield. Um, it probably helped our healer keep him alive as well, which was nice. Yeah. They actually almost made a comeback there, which was a bit worrying. But we were able to pull through there. And I didn't even look at the time. I didn't realize it was so close to ending. But it seemed to help us in the end. I mean, we still had a decent lead. But you never know. They could always make a comeback there or something like that. So... It was nice that uh, the timer ended there for us. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time.